What's up everyone? We are outside of Target and today we will be going on another Jurassic toy hunt. So let's go ahead and head inside and see if I can find anything awesome. So here we are on the toy section and unfortunately there's nothing I need. I'm basically caught up with almost everything that's out right now but it is nice to see a good healthy stock here a lot of Hammond collection which is nice um hopefully they put those down on clearance so I can pick up some extras um they got the new Indominus Rex and everything Red Rexes are plentiful for everyone now um but that's all that's right here in the little Jurassic section but right over here they have the cool end cap with the Jurassic Park 30th anniversary they got all the Lego sets out and everything like that um, and the like super colossal Indoraptor, Funkos, all that stuff. And then over here, um, you know, not much. But um, I don't think there's going to be any toys coming home from this Target with me. So although there was nothing good in the toy section I needed, they have these Jurassic World composition books, which is actually really cool um in the like school section i guess because kids are going back to school soon um and it's only 259 so i'll definitely grab that so at least i'm not leaving this target empty-handed and also over here in the like back to school section they have this pretty cool little um dress world lunchbox which is only 10 bucks so since it's cute i'll grab one of those but um yeah y'all should definitely check the back to school section because they have some random little jurassic things but i think um this and the notebook are everything that i'll be getting at this target all right so now i'm outside of hobby lobby i know i came here a few toy hunts ago and they had a lot of the jurassic stuff 40 or 50 percent off so hopefully if they still have that deal going i'll grab the couple extra extra jurassic things that i did not get so let's go inside and see if i can pick up anything so unfortunately they don't have the 40% off deal going anymore which kind of sucks but um so I won't be picking up anything but I will show y'all they still have the um paint your own t-rex bank and blue bank um they have this wood dinosaur activity which is kind of cool this is what I was gonna pick up if they had the 40% off still but they don't unfortunately so I'll wait till that deal comes back they also have this like book and flashlight set which is kind of cool and then on the next aisle over they also have like this Camp Cretaceous Imagine Ink, like, I don't know, some sort of little, I think it's like a coloring book or something. Yeah, it's like a little coloring activity book. And then they also have this kind of, I don't know, this is kind of cool, uh, Magnetic Activity Fun. That's pretty cool. It's like a little book type thing. Um, but that's most of the Jurassic stuff here, other than right over here as well. They have a few Jurassic things here, like this little um, T-Rex head thing. They have this set, which is the same thing. Um, and then they also still have this that I got on that toy hunt as well, um, design of vinyl. But yeah, I don't think they have anything um, new Jurassic that I didn't see last time and nothing's on sale, so I won't be picking up anything at this store. So now I am outside of Ross, so let's see what deals I can find inside. So on the toy section here at Ross, they do have a couple good Jurassic things. Um, they got some like Imagine X and stuff, which I don't really care about. But which is pretty cool is they have the Mega Destroyers um, Pentaceratops for only $8.99. And then they also have the um, Quetzalcoatlus for only $7.99, which is like dirt cheap. And I think I saw a second one somewhere, yeah, over there in the corner. Um, so I think, but also they have the Extreme Damage T-Rex for $9.99, which is pretty cool as well. So I think I may grab some extra Quetzalcoatluses. Um, I may grab the Pentaceratops as well. I haven't decided. Um, and I may grab a Rex. I'm not quite sure. And they also have a Roar Attack Ceratosaurus, but for $11.99, um, I'm going to pass on that one. But um, that's about everything they have Jurassic. So I'm definitely going to grab some Quetzalcoatluses, maybe the Pentaceratops as well, and maybe the T Rex. I guess we will see when I show y'all in the Jurassic room. So now I am outside of TJ Maxx, so let's see if I can find some decent deals like I did at Ross. So inside the toy section at TJ Maxx, they don't really have much. They've got an Imaginex Rex here, and of course they've got a few Imaginex things sprinkled all over the place like all these discount stores do. What's pretty cool is that they have um, a bunch of click trackers. 
and they're down to $5.99, which is pretty cheap, but even better, they have the Rowdy Roars um, Beta, and normally these go for $25 in the regular stores, and they're down to $7.99, which is really, really cheap. Um, and there's only two left. One has a smush box, so I'll probably grab this one that's got a nice, good condition box to grab an extra. But other than that, they don't have much Jurassic here, but at least I got a little something. So in the checkout line as I'm leaving, they have um, Rowdy Roars Atrociraptor as well, but unfortunately those are $12.99, unlike Beta's $7.99. And they have some Gujitsu Pyro Raptors, which are $9.99, so I won't be grabbing those, but at least um, saw some more Jurassic, but still coming back with just Beta. We are now back into the Jurassic Room and ready to take a look at the results of today's toy hunt. So here are the results of today's toy hunt. Obviously, I didn't get anything too crazy, but at least I didn't leave this toy hunt empty-handed. So first thing, um, at Target, I was able to get this new composition notebook, which is actually a really pretty um, render of Rexy from Dominion when she was kind of behind that circular-ish statue thing at the end. Um, and then on the back, of course, Jurassic World Dominion composition notebook. And then it's just a bunch of empty pages. Of course, I'm not going to use it. I will keep it as a collectible. But, you know, it's only like $2.50, which is really cool. It's kind of a good price for something this pretty. And then also at that Target, they had this cool Jurassic World uh, lunchbox. I like the little Jurassic logos on the sides, the dino footprints, which are really, really cool. And then, of course, your name and stuff on the back. Um, and then you got your little, boom, little Jurassic World tag on it as well. Then I headed over to Ross and TJ Maxx, and that's where I actually was able to find some really cool deals. I know I already own all of these toys, or actually probably multiples of all these toys, but when I can get them on really deep discount like this, I always like to stock up on extras. So first thing is we got two Quetzalcoatluses from Jurassic World Dominion. These are the massive attack versions. Um, I know these have been around for a long time. Everyone's probably seen them a million times. But they normally retail for, I believe, $23.99. And I was able to get them for $7.99, which is just like dirt cheap for, you know, actually a pretty quality figure so i grabbed both of those quetzalcoatluses that they had um at ross so we got two extras and then the last thing i got was this rowdy roars velociraptor beta which i believe this retailed for like 25.97 or something at walmart and look at this price where is it 7.99 so that is so insanely cheap that i went ahead and grabbed an extra of beta as well so maybe nothing too crazy in the toy hunt today, but got a couple little new merch items and some really good discounts on some things that have been out for quite some time now. But that is all I've got for y'all today on this Jurassic World toy hunt. If you enjoyed this video, please smash that like button and subscribe so I can continue to share my giant collection with every single one of you. Um, if you subscribe to the channel, I promise um, you will be very satisfied because I'm going to be posting regular content, four videos a week at least, um, and I don't have any plans of slowing down. So again, if you have not subscribed to my channel already, please go ahead and do that so you can stay up to date with all of my new content and new pieces coming to my collection constantly. But thank you everyone, and I will catch all of you in my next video.